but one of the things I wanted to tell you about this is never ever power this thing on until you have your water hose connected and the water turned on. The water hose connection is right here and I'm going to show you here in a minute when we test it you'll see I'm going to connect the end of the water hose here turn the water on then connect it to power and then actually power it on and you should hear that the motor come on and then stop and the motor only engages when you engage the trigger on the wand. Okay guys, I've got the power cord plugged in. You do have a 35 foot power cord with a GFI on the other end of it. One of the things like I mentioned before is you want to have your water hose connected here and you want to make sure you have the water turned on before you ever turn the power switch on here. And a quick way to always test before you turn the motor on is just pull the trigger 